Good morning, everybody. My name is Daniel Pello, coming to you here from First Presbyterian Church in Covington, Virginia. Starting out on this Thanksgiving Day with a scripture reading from Matthew chapter 20, verses 1 through 16. For the kingdom of heaven is like a landowner who went out early in the morning to hire laborers for his vineyard. After agreeing with the laborers for the usual daily wage, he sent them into his vineyard. When he went out about nine o'clock, he saw others standing idle in the marketplace, and he said to them, You also go into the vineyard, and I will pay you whatever is right. So they went. When he went out again about noon and about three o'clock, he did the same. About five o'clock he went out and found others standing around, and he said to them, Why are you standing here idle all day? They said to him, Because no one has hired us. He said to them, You also go into the vineyard. When evening came, the owner of the vineyard said to his manager, Call the laborers and give them their pay, beginning with the last and then going to the first. When those hired about five o'clock came, each of them received the usual daily wage. Now when the first came, they thought they would receive more, but each of them also received the usual daily wage. And when they received it, they grumbled against the landowner, saying, These last worked only one hour. And you have made them equal to us who have borne the burden of the day and the scorching heat. But he replied to one of them, Friend, I am doing you no wrong. Did you not agree with me for the usual daily wage? Take what belongs to you and go. I choose to give to this last the same as I give to you. Am I not allowed to do what I choose with what belongs to me? Or are you envious because I am generous? So the last will be first, and the first will be last. As I read for this morning, if you will, please join me now in a time together in prayer. Let us pray together. Dear Heavenly Father, on this Thanksgiving Day, we bow our hearts to you and pray. We give you thanks for all that you have done, especially for the gift of your Son, Jesus, for your Son, and for beauty and nature, and for your glory that we see, for joy and health, and especially for our friends and family that we are surrounded by today, for your daily provision, for your mercy and care. These are the blessings that you graciously share. So today we offer this response of praise with a promise to follow you in all of our days onward. Please be with those that are traveling today, to and from, and we thank you again for the food and for friends and family today. And we also pray for those who cannot be with family today because of numerous reasons or obstacles that they may face. For all these things we pray in Jesus' name, amen. Thank you all for joining me here this morning. Hope to see you here tomorrow at 8 a.m. Hope you all have a great Thanksgiving day today. Happy Thanksgiving.